Ignition sequence start. Six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. All engine running. Liftoff. We have a liftoff. 32 minutes past the hour. have been explorers and inventors, pilgrims and pioneers, always searching for something new across the oceans, across the continent, across the solar system, across the frontiers of science, beyond the boundaries of the human mind. continue our quest in space. There will be more shuttle flights, and more shuttle crews, and yes, more volunteers, more civilians, more teachers in space. Nothing ends here. Our hopes and our journeys continue. This year, 1998, men and women from 16 countries will build a foothold in the heavens. The International Space Station, with its vast expanses, scientists and engineers will actually set sail on an uncharted sea of limitless mystery and unlimited potential. More than 40 years ago, astronauts descended the nine-rung ladder of the lunar module called Eagle and allowed their feet to touch the dusty surface of the Earth's only moon. This was the culmination of a daring and perilous gambit, of an endeavor that pushed the boundaries of our knowledge, of our technical prowess, of our very capacity as human beings to solve problems. It wasn't just the greatest achievement in NASA's history, it was one of the greatest achievements in human history. And the question for us now is whether that was the beginning of something or the end of something. I choose to believe it was only the beginning. 